question was if I'm a customer, if I'm a developer and I'm building using Amazon's web services storage technology, why would I consider, and I'm not running the Oracle database there, why would I consider moving to using the Oracle Cloud? I, I first want to just make sure people understand we have a lot of customers in the world who run Oracle technology, our database and our middleware. The first goal with the Oracle Cloud is to appeal to those customers. Um, for example, we have a number of people who say, hey, I, I'm using Oracle database or I'm planning to use Oracle database for a project. My IT department has not yet installed and configured it yet. I, I want to build an application in the cloud using Oracle and then if I want to move it on premise because my IT guys are going to use it, I can do that. And the Oracle Cloud gives you the most seamless experience with Oracle technology. Now, to answer your specific question, if you run Amazon, if you're using Amazon, why would you consider Oracle uh, for something like the storage service? I would say there are two reasons. First and foremost, we our storage service runs on our engineered systems, and as a result, it gives you very, very good performance and scalability. Uh, I'm not suggesting Amazon is a bad product. I just think they have differentiation in quality of service. Uh, performance and scale. And then secondly, we also support a number of different types of storage uh, abstractions. You can store files, you can store database blobs, and you can also store um, a key value type data structures within our storage service. And then finally, many people, when they're building an application, they want to secure it in a consistent way so that your permissions on who's allowed to see the, the data in the file system, uh, in the object storage layer, and we've got some differentiation in that area as well.